Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, we are going to welcome the new RF01 tennis racket line to you. Stay tuned. Hey guys, do you need help organizing your tennis life? Well, think go! We got the Axiom line here, the 9-pack duffel, my favorite bag, the 9-pack Axiom 2.0. They even make a 12-pack if you're going on tour. And my favorite backpack of all time. I love that bag. So if you want to organize your tennis life, think go. Sorry guys, I was raising my voice at you. Uh, I was a little excited because I really wanted to uh, get into this RF and I'm sure, I'm sure Coach Rob is too. Now, there's three rackets in the line. Uh, they all look the same except that they're, they're different weightings, okay? There's three different weights. I'm going to ask Coach Rob which one he wants to start with. Do you want to start with the Roger version? Do you want to start with the light version? Or do you want to start with the middle version? All right. So, of course, Roger, Coach Rob. Roger. <laughs> Roger. All right. So, let's hold this up and uh, see what we got here. We got the RF01. It says 16 by 19. Yep. 11.3. Nine points headlight. Yep. Ninety-eight square inches. Fifty to sixty is the range. Interesting. Ninety-eight square inch head. And this is the Roger version. It's no longer twelve ounces. Huh. So they went lighter and one square inch bigger. What do you think of that shape? Cool. Yeah, no. Looks kind of egg. A little bit, but no, it looks fine. Cool paint color. It's not all kinda, black. It, it changes, yeah. right? Like in some moments, it's kind of a dark gray. Uh -huh. And then you look at it elsewhere, it turns into like a light silver. So it's kind of a cool metallic-y uh, looking color. It looks kind of graphite, like a yeah. dark graphite color. Right. Interesting thing about What's the... What's the O one though? Oh, one. Hasn't there been the pro staff Federer? Yeah, but I think that was pro staff. This is now RF. Okay. So this is Roger's own line that's not within the pro staff line now. So RF, Roger Federer, O one, meaning version one, which means there could be more to come, version two, and so on. Now, this is now called the pro. I wish. I wish I had more information than what's on the placard because that looks a little thicker to me, which means that uh, it's going to have a little bit more power. Um, let's look at the throat area here. It's long. See the, the length in here? And this is short. This has six holes on the bottom, which means that it should, it should, flex a little bit more because sometimes when this goes out and there's eight grommet holes on the bottom it alters things a little bit more so traditional six hole grommet right. in the bridge um yeah it looks like a constant beam to me they it's don't got the say. cool rf uh, butt cap oh, yeah, it does have the rf got a couple rfs on the side got another rf in the center so you know when you're stringing where the middle of the racket is okay the question that everybody always asks me, does the butt cap have a sharp edges? I would say no. Okay. Because I remember only in the RF edition that it had sharp edges. I know this one doesn't. This does not. That does not. Nope. Okay. Okay. So... Uh, leather grip under there. We were so excited that we were wanted to play with it um, that we threw a 
over grip over already. <laughs> okay. I mean, now, was it a black leather grip or was it the brown I, leather grip? I think it was tan. It was tan. tan. It was tan. Okay, tan. Yeah. So it was a tan over grip, uh, tan replacement grip, just like old school Fairway, yes. but made by Wilson. Um, Fairway was made by Wilson? No, no, no. I always thought they were, but they're not. Okay. They're not. And then we got the middleweight version, which is not like a pro staff. I'm going to have you hand that. Because uh, the current pro staff in the slightly lighter version, version 13, version 14, 14 in America doesn't have an RF. So that particular pro staff version was 11.1 before strings. This, on the other hand, in the RF01 series, is 98 square inch head, 10.6 ounces without strings, which is 300 grams, 9 points headlight, just like the Fed version, 27 inches long. Or as they call it, the Pro version. Oh, sorry. Pro version. Yes. So they just call this one RF01. That's it. So RF01. Same color scheme. Um, do they actually say? Yes, they do. They say the weight and um, the balance on the inside. So all they really had to do on this was just change the weight on this, right? right. They didn't really do any. Did they do anything special on the inside of that where the 01 is? No, they didn't. Just says Pro. Oh, it says Pro. Pro 1619, 11.3 ounces, 320 grams, 9 point headlight. Yep. Yep. So, so how about the other side? Nothing. The other side got the grip size and then says Roger plus Wilson yeah, yeah, yeah. designed yeah. and engineered for the next generation of creative tennis players. So Chicago. Chicago. USA. Not made in Chicago. It just says Chicago, USA. Oh, yeah. There's some Pro other fine print that designed. That there's no way I, my eyes can read. They can't see it. Made in China. Eye. Yep, made in China. Is that what it says? Yeah, yeah made in China. <laughs> Anyways, it's not made in St. Vincent. Uh, so these are the two heavy version, 10.6, 300 ounces. Um, I do feel a significant weight in the head, even though they say nine points head light. Right? Right. I would think it would be a little head lighter, but there's definitely good heft in it, even though it's 300 grams. Now, the final one is RF01, and they call this the future. Why do you think they call this the future? Because this could be the future of, the future of a tennis in America when they, the kids use this one and they get good and they move up to the middleweight and then get great, and then move up to the Roger. Cool. There you go. <laughs> do, you think, uh, do you think that's right? That's why they call it the future? If you say so, Harry. <laughs> <laughs> but they do call it the future. Check it out. And they call it up front here. Future 16 by 19. And so, yeah. Uh, future, yeah, 16 by 19 is what it says. So 98 square inch head, 9.9 .9 ounces before strings, which is 280 grams. Seven points headlight, so two points headlighter than those two. Uh, again, 27 inches. They're all about the same beam, and they're all the same size head. Same color scheme, too. Yeah. All right. So what do you leather, think? Leather grip underneath as well? No, these two are pleather. It, it is brown, but they're pleather. Really? Yes. Okay, I'll take yeah. your word for it. Yeah, and that's the only real leather. But yeah, pleather on these two, real leather on the pro version. So what do you think? You excited? Let's go hit. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Coach Rob. We're going to go hit right after this. Guys, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.